Hello, today we will learn how to install Nop Commerce 3.8. Okay, so let's start. First of all, open Google and ask Google to show Nop Commerce. For this one, write down Nop Commerce here. Nop Commerce go here and then go to the download knob commerce here you can find knob commerce web i mean direct installer here you will get knob commerce source code and here you will get upgrade script so if you have like knob commerce 3.7 or 3.6 you can upgrade to knob commerce 3.8 so who are just starting knob commerce this one knob commerce source code click here and okay oh, I need to click again okay so it is downloading for me so I have already a downloaded version in my directory so I'll change I will open a folder here like this one not up commerce open up this one and paste here now extract the zip file here so I have seven zip I'll extract here it will take some time to extract everything after extracting knob commerce you will get a solution file you can open this one with visual studio i have visual studio 12 2015 so i will open up with the Visual Studio here. So if you don't have Visual Studio, you can go Visual Studio website and can download the Community Edition. So I go here or open up the Visual Studio and then go open Project Solution, then go to Desktop here. Here is my knob commerce, knob commerce solution, and open. Now it will take some time to load all the projects and solution. So here is my knob commerce. So knob commerce have one, two, three four directory and here is in under the library you will get core project data project service and in presentation you will get the web project so this is the main project for the web so you need to run this one so it is already selected if it is not selected right click here and select this project a like is the executable like set as a startup project now if you run this from here it will open up the installation browser remember here knob commerce will install a database for you so if you don't have any database in your local machine then you have to install sql server or oracle or others in your 
machine so I have SQL Server 2014 in my machine and I can I will install knob commerce using this database so here so first of all the default is admin .com. you can as a local host you can use this one then use password I'm using password as a simple password for my local I'm not telling you what the password I am using here now for this one I am using create sample data so that I can show you guys now the use SQL server or SQL Express database recommended so SQL server if you don't have SQL server install this one if you don't know how to install it look to my other videos and install SQL server so uh, so I'm tick this box because if there is no database create the database one now here what you need to do is you need to create one DB server for my case this is my server name my database name is anything like sample db and my username is sa and my password so for this case I'm not using user just I'm using Windows authentication because this is my local I don't care much now click install okay now we got our sample site so this is knob commerce website now we have created the admin so if you want to log in as an admin go admin at your store.com it is already populated because I have used this email address before and the password set your password click login Ah uh, my goodness so it is not working so I have to go add let's see yes now it works okay now if so you got one administration panel here click on the administration and you will get all the panel here like dashboard catalog sales and you can configure your website pretty much from here so that's it for today please look at my other videos thank you